Pascal's law is used in which technique of hernia repair? Options are Lichtenstein mesh repair, Bessinis repair, and Stopos preperitoneal repair and Donning repair. So the answer for this question is Stopos preperitoneal repair. Okay, we will go for the discussion. So the Pascal's law. What is Pascal's law? So first, I am going to. Uh, discuss about the Pascal's law with an just a simple example. Okay, just to take this is a bathtub. Okay, where you are putting a stopper from inside inside the bathtub you are putting a stopper. Then fill it with water. Then fill it with water completely. Then you can see that the pressure is exerted like this over the stopper so that is causing the more firm gripping of the stopper so that there is no leakage of the water imagine if the stopper you are going to keep from outside what will happen if you are uh, filling with water the water pressure causes the stopper to come out and the water will be leaked so this is the pascal's law so the same thing you can apply in the hernia repair also for example in case of stopos repair so first i am putting this is the blue color is the peritoneum and next one this is anterior abdominal wall and this yellow space is the preperitoneal space okay preperitoneal space and consider this is the hernia defect the black color that is a hernia defect okay so the pascal's law act suppose if you are going to keep a mesh in the preperitoneal plane then so this is a preperitoneal plane so you are going to keep a mesh posterior to the defect okay the defect is here and posterior to the defect you are keeping in the preperitoneal plane the pressure okay intra abdominal pressure will be exerted like this like this the pressure will be exerting and that causes the uh, as like that uh, stopper here the mesh is going to act and prevent the recurrent of the herniation uh, this is called inlay technique so the stopos repair is an open uh, method and where you are going to keep the mesh in the preperitoneal space and similar based on the same principle you are going to use in laparoscopic hernia surgeries that is a trans abdominal preperitoneal repair and uh, totally extra peritoneal repair and other options what they are given is the lichtenstein mesh repair uh, bessinis repair and donning repair are all only techniques so there they are going to keep the mesh in the anterior to the defect okay so so that is the reason uh, the option other options are ruled out so pascal's law uh, according to pascal's law you have to keep the mesh in the preperitoneal plane